13 Investigates is uncovering the first link between a fake social media profile run by Kagan Klein and the unsolved Delphi murders. So far, he has never been charged, but Klein was arrested in August of 2020 on 30 charges of child exploitation and pornography. In the transcript of that 2020 police interview with Klein, just a few days after the bodies of Libby and Abby were discovered in Carroll County, Another school age girl gave her address to the Anthony Schatz profile. That girl was getting off the school bus when she says she saw a man in a ski mask looking into her bedroom window. Now, Klein personally knew the girl and her family. And then five days later, police raided the home where Klein lived with his father in Miami County. They found over 100 sexually explicit images of underage girls on several devices. Now, in the 2020 interview, police questioned Klein about whether his father had access to those devices. The person behind Anthony Schott's profile was one of the last communications with Libby German before her murder. And after her death, the Anthony Schott's profile told another person that he was supposed to meet up with Libby, but she never showed up. But look at what police told Kagan. Quote, I can honestly sit here and I'm telling you that I do not believe that you killed Liberty. Kagan Klein is not charged with the killings of Liberty Germain Abby Williams, as we've mentioned. Police did tell Klein, though, they believe a second person was communicating with the girls using his devices. Klein did not implicate his father either. Now, police are not saying if he has been questioned in the Delphi case.